Hello and welcome to episode 12 of Fappy Farmer Against Potatoes Expedition Update. I'm a bit late because I was gone for part of holidays, but now we're back at the game. I'm a bit behind. I'm gonna try to catch up. You're gonna see the tutorial, but by the end of the video, I'll be more comfortable with it. And next episode, when we reach Ascension 5, because we won't in this one, then uh, I'll have a better understanding of this uh, expedition thing. So, that's a normal tutorial as usual. I had a little bit of trouble at first, so I'm gonna fast forward a little part. Okay, they just explain uh, to click on an area, okay, to um, start doing expedition, and when you reach a certain wave in an area, it unlocks a new area. But here, um, I'm having trouble. They say click on lowdown. That's the mistake that I made. I just realized that I was trying to attribute a pet, but I couldn't. They say click. It's right there in green. Uh, so I fast forward this part. You got to select a loadout. There you go. And now it's going to work. I click on the pet and I put it. There you go. That's better. Now, which pet should I use, though? So I chose uh, random pets. But the thing is, three out of four pets I will choose are already busy. I don't know if you see the little orange swords, that means they're being used in the normal game. So I cannot do that. So I'll realize this in the next step, of course, it's my first exposure to expeditions. And they'll tell me I can't do it. So let's uh, save this for now, I'm gonna have to change it. I only have one loadout, it will be useful to have more in the future, but for now, we'll stick to that. So we choose an area, and then attribute a loadout. And it says, one or more pets are already busy. So I'll sort this out and we'll go to next clip. Thanks to people's advice, I used the milk upgrade in the Ascension shop, which enabled me to reach 75,000 residue. I had trouble before getting such numbers. It's no longer a problem. You'll see what I'll get once I reach Ascension 5. Do I already have plans? But I will keep that milk upgrade forever. It's amazing. And we're grading a little bit the blood supply reincarnation XP. Okay, because I'm trying to move forward as fast as possible. Did you see that new pet? I forgot to record when I got it. Anyways, I'm going to make the team that I would use at the beginning of any uh, any reincarnation. Look at the bonus on the right with the synergy. So I was trying with this new pet. This is the new pet, okay? But it doesn't do much but look at this one bang look on the right i got three uh, special combo bonuses and it covers potatoes skulls glass and confection xp perfect setup for the beginning of a reincarnation so what do i do for expedition that's the question you know so i cannot use any of those now i'm going to use this pet but this pet i use it at the end of a reincarnation it does have to level up also, so I'm gonna have to figure this out. Thankfully, I got a new pet uh, right after this video. That's going to help. Anyways, we just sent our first thing. We'll see what it gives, how it works. Uh, and then uh, we'll take a look at the upgrades that you can get with a certain currency that they give you. 99% left to go in wave one. That's gonna take a while. I'm starting though. So. This is bad, I think. Increase minimum item rating. I don't think it's so great. Unless I'm wrong, you can let me know in the comments. I think that's good though. Isn't it the same thing that you get in the reincarnation shop? Head scratcher. Skull upgrade attack speed doesn't reset on reincarnation anymore. 60 points. You're gonna see. You're gonna see you don't get that much. Unlock a new pet slot. Nice for ground. That's really good. And then one for air. I really want those two, that's for sure. Allow to automatically reset an expedition when it's finished. Okay, it could be interesting. I'm not sure yet because I need more experience. Increase expedition that can be sent at the same time by one. That's nice. Yeah, sure. When finishing an expedition, you are earning a random resource. Well, with this, it seems that we get to get one ascension point. But there's only three levels. Uh, I think this is a loadout, yeah. That seems to be a normal loadout for everyday play. And this is for Expedition, I believe. If I say something wrong, please let me know in the comments. I'm doing my best here. It's the first time I get exposed to this. Increased chance to get a pet by 5%. It's pretty nice. Pet damage by 5%. And multiply attack and HP by 5%. 
uh, I don't know if it's in the main game or only in Expedition. Look at that, there's a bunch. That's going to be very interesting. I just need to spend time on it and next episode will be more advanced and I'll be able to make more comments uh, regarding this as you can see and it still needs 2000 reincarnation levels and it's not that fast but we'll make it. Okay we're gonna finish our first expedition but while I was going, well, it's only one hour, I stopped playing completely, I was gone, came back from uh, holidays for one point that's because it ran only for one hour. I think it's going to take a while before I get a lot of points. Some of these uh, upgrades are really nice in the shop. So I'm going to put the same team, um, but I'm going to have to make some changes because one of the pets is uh, related to reincarnation XP. Also, there's other pets that I use for item rating. But anyways, I'll explain what my plan is. By the way, I get 5% attack and HP for that one wave completed. I'm going to go for a few hours. I wasn't sure, so I decided for four hours. And then, uh, if I remember correctly, with this run, we'll be able to unlock the second area. Because you got to reach wave 5 in the Butternut Forest. And look at that card update is coming up. That's going to be very interesting. I can't wait. Let's jump ahead four hours or more and finish our second expedition. Five points this time. I wanted to see again the amounts because some of the footage is pretty old from before Christmas. Six points. I can buy this, but I really don't want it. Uh, what I'm interested in is this and the flying one. So I might be saving for that. What do you think of this idea? That's my plan for now. So I found a way to sort out my pets. At the beginning of reincarnation, the fourth first pet would be used because of the nice bonuses that I showed you earlier in the video. Then, if I need to get items, or if I'm about to reincarnate, the team I'm building right now would be, in fact, I'm gonna save it in the first loadout, that would be my team. So when I'm farming for gear, and yeah, when I'm about to reincarnate this one okay so i'm going to save that then i'll make my first uh, official expedition loadout it's comprised of the vulture of course and three pets that i never use at least for now uh, and things will change as i get more pets find new combos and of course better synergies than 1.5 synergy bonus i suspect it's low <laughs> Does it go up when your pets level up? I don't know. So now I want last XP from Cheddar Plane. And uh, wave 1 doesn't seem too bad compared to wave 9 of the first area. We're gonna go for 2 hours. I wasn't sure how long I would be gone, okay. Then we'll go to the Soul Shop and then will be the last clip of the video already. I'll give you a visual of what I got. I can't click on everything, it will be too long. Uh, so this is what I bought so far, and there's something I'm going to buy, I got 15,000, increase the pet rank XP earned in Expedition by 25%, I decided to buy this, but I want this, okay, and I want that as well. And that, I don't really care about it, to be frank. In fact, I can't find anything that I'm really that attracted to. Uh, what else can I get? Okay, I can get loadouts maybe when I have uh, extra souls that I don't uh, know how to spend, but uh, like this, it's not really uh, important. I can type daily on my own, you know what I mean? So I'm not really interested in any of this. Okay, let's go to the last clip and if you ever ask me for certain stats, I'll show you that and please let me know in the comments if that's what you wanted. So these are my most recent reincarnation times. And when it comes to ascension, it's been getting faster, but for number five, it will be way longer because I stopped playing, unfortunately. Okay. And this is my gear. When I get new equipment, I always look at reincarnation XP trying to increase it a little bit to make ascension faster. So now next video, we're gonna reach ascension five, but I might wait a little bit I might um, go through part of Ascension 5 
so I can understand Expedition better and show you my progress in Expedition have a little bit of substance. And also watch Discord to see if the card update comes out. I don't want a conflict between my um, progress in Expedition and card update. I really want to keep them separate. It's the best I could do with what I had, but I'm back in the game. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please hit thumbs up and leave a comment below. If you want to support this channel, you can subscribe and hit the notification bell to make sure you don't miss future videos. Thank you for watching and see you next time.